sound. He's done a great job with the numerous solos that he's had as well during our performances the past three years. And we'll certainly miss him, perhaps most on the ultimate Frisbee field. Case McIntyre. <laughs> Another French Morris that will be leaving us this year, Alice and Yonda. Allison was in Wind on, or concert band for three years and has been in Wind Ensemble this year. Uh, she has helped to make this horn section probably one of the best I've ever had. She was also a member of the C team, CD team this year. Um, everybody loves Allison, except, except maybe Chick, who I think picks on her incessant, incessantly from day one. Sounds kind of like he's got a crush on her to me. <gasps> oh! <laughs> Just a guess. <laughs> uh, okay, Allison's going to kill me now. Uh, she is a wonderful musician, a very talented singer, piano player, and French hornist who has made so many significant contributions to our entire department. She was also charming as the lovable Mrs. Potts in Beauty and the Beast. Just don't let that quiet exterior mislead you. She's ambitious, confident, and very capable, and I know she'll be successful. Allison Yamba. Staying with our brass section, we have one tuba player that is doing the graduation thing this year, John Avery. John was in concert band as a freshman and has been in wind ensemble for the past three years, including twice as section leader. He's participated in a solo festival at both the middle school level and the high school level. And John is another soft-spoken, talented musician. You would never guess that this quiet, polite, and respectful tuba player was also one of the school's best wrestlers. But perhaps even more impressive, impressive is his collection of finger puppets. <laughs> we do a posture prize almost every day here in Wind Ensemble as part of our warm-up exercises. And it seems every time that he, or in fact any member of the tuba section wins, the prize happens to be a finger puppet. Almost as nice as collecting freshmen. John Avery. In our trumpet section, Aaron Carroll. Aaron was also a member of concert band in ninth grade and has been in wind ensemble since then, including once as a first chair player. She has been a member of jazz ensemble for two years, uh, did private study throughout much of high school, solo festival numerous times, including some wonderful level six ratings, uh, was in Pitt Orchestra the past two years, was part of the CD team, twice was selected to All County, and also was the first one every time that we had a request from the community and some veterans in particular for someone to play taps. Um, she was always the first one to volunteer and has done wonderful community service providing that for our veterans. She's just another example of you can't judge a book by its cover. For about three years, Aaron showed nothing but hard work, impeccable responsibility, great motivation, respect, and politeness, all of which is the real deal. But once you get her laughing, good night. <laughs> it's over. She can't talk. She can't think. She can't breathe. <laughs> it's just done. You, you wouldn't know it, but she's gone. All right. Aaron Carroll. Another trumpet, next to Aaron, is Haley Chapman. <laughs> Haley was in concert band as a freshman and has been in wind ensemble for the past three years. She also was a part of jazz ensemble for the first time this year as a senior. She did solo festival one time and did a duet with Aaron another time. Um, was part of the CD team this year. And speaking of laughing, she happened to be in a lesson group with Aaron this year, and once Aaron got going, and quite often before that, Haley also would be pretty much in the tank. About 50 to 60 percent of our lesson time was spent laughing. Um, once they stopped laughing, their duets actually sounded pretty nice. 
Um, she's another exemplary student and valued member of both wind ensemble and jazz ensemble. She's headed to the University of Buffalo next year to pursue art, as well as her hidden talent as a member of the UB crew team, Haley Chapman. <laughs> And one more trumpet player, John Wild Rice. <laughs> John has been a member of Wind Ensemble for all four years, including a first chair player three different years. He's also been a three-year member of the Jazz Ensemble. Uh, he had private, private lessons on trumpet throughout high school. He did solo festivals six different times, all level six, including that top rating of A+. Uh, he was selected to all county as well as three times to area all state. The past two years, he's been a member of our pit orchestra. He was in the CD team this year. And John is another quiet, respectful, ultra responsible, and he's really been a section leader from the middle of the section the past couple of years now. He always is the first to prepare his parts, first to hand forms in, has about 90% of his music memorized, never takes his eyes off the conductor. I can't overemphasize his value to our trumpet section and to all of our groups. And I'll never forget his inimitable chainsaw dance at Disney. John, you want to give us a little chainsaw dance? No. <laughs> I didn't think so. John Wild Rice. <laughs> Moving into our low brass, we have Two trombone players, the first of which is Willie Middleton. <laughs> Willie's been in wind ensemble for four years, including three years as a section leader and one year as a bass trombone player. He's also been in jazz ensemble for four years, including twice as a co-section leader. Uh, private study throughout most of high school. Solo festival six different times, including a few of those six A plus ratings. He was selected to all county in jazz. He's made area all state band and orchestra and was only the 10th person in the history of the district to be selected for conference all state two different consecutive years. He was a member of the pit orchestra for the past two years, was on the CD team this year, uh, also received an outstanding soloist award for his work with the jazz ensemble in Virginia Beach this year. He's been a member of the Eastman Youth Jazz Ensemble. If you can imagine being 14 years old, being featured as a soloist on an instrument that's not even your major instrument, and the venue was Lincoln Center. That's where Willie was three years ago. Um, I think he was probably too young to be real nervous about it. He nailed the solo that evening, uh, and actually was congratulated on stage at Lincoln Center by Wynton Marsalis for an outstanding soloist award, which is pretty cool. Um, certainly one of the top musicians in the band, very versatile in both classical and jazz idioms, on bass trombone, tenor trombone, tuba. He's headed to the University of Vermont to follow his passion as a music major next year, Willie Middleton. <laughs> and part of our dynamic duo in the trombone section, Kari Forstrom. Kari's been in wind ensemble since her freshman year, including twice as co-section leader. Has been uh, in jazz ensemble for the past six years, including twice as co-section leader. She did solo festival four times, including two ratings of 6A+. Plus. Twice was selected for all county, twice was selected for area all state. Was in the pit orchestra for the past two years, once on trombone and once on keyboard. Um, also received an outstanding soloist award for the Jazz Ensemble in Virginia Beach this year, and was another member of the 2007 Essentially Ellington Jazz Ensemble. Um, I've had the privilege of working with Kari since she was in Matter School. Uh, she's one of only a few kids to have been in Jazz Ensemble since seventh grade, and she's made terrific contributions to the program. But what I think I've been impressed with the most about Kari was the time when things weren't going very well. I've had dozens and dozens of kids over the year that have had braces. It's just part of the part of the deal here. But I've never had anyone struggle with braces as much as Kari did her freshman year when she had the braces put on. Uh, it got to the point where she had been a level five 
perfect 100 player at the end of eighth grade, uh, put the braces on, couldn't even play a B flat scale. 